Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So good to be back. I love it, you guys. I have been working back to back on videos uh, for you guys. I am really excited about this one. I did a turquoise. Seriously, I said turquoise. I'm sorry, you guys, my apologies. Tortoise, I keep saying it wrong every single time. I did a tortoise look and it is gorgeous. Um, in this video, I ended up putting an extra footage video in there. I was not satisfied with the first uh, design that I did. I did it all wrong in the beginning. Um, I kind of wanted to do like a blonde uh, tortoise look. Um, and I ended up using, my goodness, where is this color? I just had it here, you guys. I ended up using this one color because I wanted to make it like Milky Way. This is a very beautiful Milky, Milky Way color that I thought that would be so pretty. Where I went wrong is how I put the coat and then I had to do obviously um, the layers with the, uh, with the brown. I tried to put a little bit of the orange um, and I went with the black. That did not work out. So um, I show you guys, but a lot of people actually, um, they really did like that uh, design that I did. I personally did not like it too much. I felt that I did way too much work on it and I ended up covering up the gold foils, which I kind of did. I encapsulated it all underneath to make it look like this. And I had gone over it with the Milky Way and I kind of ruined it. And then I had to do, you know, the little spots and all of the, of the tortoise and that did not work out. Um, but like I said, some people liked it because I ended up putting gold foils and I guess it kind of worked out because some people liked it. Some people, um, love this one the best. It just depends on what you feel like doing with this whole, uh, design for yourself. I personally liked the second design. Um, so I have two of them on there so you can take your pick either you like the first one or you like the second one It's all up to you. Um, I really enjoyed doing this nail set. Uh, I went and got these uh, new nail tips and um, As you can see they kind of look a little curvy. I've never worked with curvy like this when it comes to stiletto um, I have worked with curved nails before and I really, 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 you guys know I love my curved nails. I love to do, you know, this kind of thing. I'm also really excited. Um, a lot of people have requested for me to t start doing all those um, ASMRs with my nails, food, um, all kinds of stuff. So if you guys check out the channel, I have brought you guys all kinds of little shorts, uh, videos, and um food little videos um you know a little tapping and that kind of thing um and everybody seems to enjoy it i mean just i had just barely started you guys with that whole thing and i literally got like 187 subscribers like from one day to another everybody was just so excited and i got all these new subscribers so I'm thinking I must be doing something right because, you know, when you barely start this journey, you're like, oh my gosh, what do I do? You kind of want to go with the trend. Then you kind of want to be yourself and do your own thing. And it's just, it's a lot. There's a lot to YouTube. But in this journey, you all know that I am just having a blast. I love to do my nails. I love to share my ideas with all of you guys. And that is what I like to do. Share my ideas with you guys. I really do hope you guys enjoyed these videos that I have new coming up for you guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe and give me some feedback. I don't mind the negative feedback or the positive feedback. It really doesn't matter. Um, I always acknowledge everyone. I am a very humble person and respectful and I really do enjoy what I do you guys. And you know, you guys have thrown me out all your ideas of ASMRs, food videos and everything. 
and I hope I'm making everybody happy with what I'm doing. If there's other ideas you guys have, please feel free to let me know. I love to do these videos for you guys and they're a lot of fun. Um, so this is our fall vibes and definitely these fit in with the fall. I think they are super cute and I love it. I haven't even taken them off. Uh, I'm supposed to start a new video and I don't want to take these off. They're so cute that I just like, it's like they're too cute. So I hope you guys will like them. So we'll be doing some ASMR stuff that you guys have requested. I'm waiting for my microphone because I want to do this fun for you guys. Um, just as much as you guys have fun, I will have fun with it too. Um, so hopefully I'm fitting in the uh, fall vibe. I hope so. Uh, as you guys can see, the hair is black. I haven't been working on the makeup as much as I should. I know I told you guys that I was gonna work on the makeup videos. Um, never got around to it. When it's not one thing, it's another. I'm gonna be a grandma, you all know that. In March, our baby's coming in this world. Um, the coming new year, of course. And it's a little baby boy. Um, I do tell you guys on the other video, which is my Hello Kitty Kawaii look, and I'm letting you know now on our tortoise nail set in case that I forgot or that I, yeah, that I thought I didn't tell you guys, but I guess I did. Ah! Anyways, you guys, let's enjoy the fall this year. Um, let's just enjoy it, you guys. Um, I still want to do a chit chat with you guys. I haven't decided if I'm going to do live stream. Um, and let's pick up uh, a nice pumpkin spice latte. I can't wait for that. I haven't even had it, you guys. That is crazy. Um, from my understanding, they didn't have it. I know that Dunkin' Donuts, I believe they had it already. So I'm not sure. Actually, I'm gonna call Starbucks and find out because I don't even know. But we are uh, on September and these are our fall vibes, you guys. So. Enjoy the video, and I will see you guys on my next video. Thank you guys. Have a good one. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. How's everyone doing? I am having a great day today. I came up with this um, great idea for a nail design for the fall. Um, I did get this really beautiful nail polish as well, green one. It's kind of like, it almost looked like kind of the army colors, but it's really cute. And right here we have the nude colors uh, from Beatles. It's a little box with just different colors. Um, you can always use whatever color you want as far as like brown, as you guys can see. This is very brown and I use um, some black. I have right here that Milky Way color. So it's just like a little milky white. It's really, really cute. Um, right here as you guys can see I already had the nails done so we skipped all those steps this is just pretty much the nail design that I wanted to do for you guys um, right here we as you guys can see we encapsulated and we put uh, gold foils I did one coat of the milky white and then we went ahead and used um, some of the blooming gel uh, and we used some brown on our first design because um, as you remember you guys I did two designs in this one video um, and right here is a blooming gel that I'm gonna use so we're gonna put one coat of it and obviously you're not gonna cure it and then we're gonna go ahead and um, use the colors that we're gonna try to use as far as um, trying to do like a, a tortoise look I have this orangey color here uh, from Motolones and then um, I use from the Beatles the brown and the black so on this design this one's totally different from the second one this one I ended up covering up the foils which I had encapsulated underneath and I was supposed to let them show I had no idea um, that I was gonna cover them up the way I did but even so, even though that I did cover up um, the foils, it still came out really cute. 
a lot of people did like this design on YouTube um, so I went ahead and left it in here for you guys in case that you guys wanted to try this one out and um, we're gonna go with the second one uh, soon and you guys will get to see the difference because on the second one we're only gonna use the brown and the black and we're gonna leave out the orange and the um, the milky white those two are those three are gonna be left out as you guys can see we're gonna use all of these colors I feel that I did a lot of work with this design um, I'm not very good with the tortoise uh, designs. I feel that I need a lot of practice. Um, so as I took my time, because right here I feel like I was rushing, I was a little distracted, even though that I really did enjoy doing this. I was a little distracted. Um, but as I, as I did my second design, I went really slow on it, um, even with the movements of the brush. I didn't think about it too much like right here I'm just thinking way too much where to put the spots and when you do that when you're when you're overthinking something that's when it just it doesn't go your way and even though that the design came out cute I was not satisfied with what I wanted to do with this design so I went ahead and did a second one for you guys I did leave it in there um, that way uh, you guys get to pick which one you guys like the most as you guys can see right here where I'm putting some more of the um, of the milky white and that's where I go wrong um, I wanted to do more like a blonde uh, tortoise look and um, I just I couldn't I couldn't do it the way I wanted to so I'm definitely going to come back and do another video because I still want to do that blonde uh, tortoise design that is so cute. So right here, um, you guys get to see this one design. And then um, I put gold foils and all. So if you guys are wondering, as far as my, my that little box with all those little nude colors from the Beatles, um, they're like seven something. They're under ten dollars. That's all I know. I can't remember all the prices you guys I always I always try to stay on my budget though So that whole little box probably cost me like under ten dollars And then as you guys can see I have the little foils here if you do order them on Amazon They can send you like a box of six or seven and you know you get them for like maybe seven dollars um and then obviously we have um, the Milky Way, I mean Milky Way, Milky White. I have it, uh, like a whole box and they're like kind of like see-through-ish colors. And I think that one too, under $10, I usually uh, try to get my little um, gel polishes and all. So this definitely, these are good deals on Amazon. You guys might want to check it out. They do have great deals. Um, I mostly get all my stuff from Amazon uh, Plus I have this membership with them so they ship everything within the second day I get my stuff which really works out for me uh, So I really did enjoy doing this design. Um, it was a lot of fun Obviously, I overthink everything way too much um, And when you do that, like I said um, Then you're not satisfied with what you're trying to do but even so, I think it was cute. These nail tips, I didn't, I didn't show you guys um, because I did not know it was that it was a lot of work. These are kind of like not curvy, but they're just like wide. They're totally different from the ones I've worked with. Um, I usually get everything really thin, and it's like that skinny look. But this time, I wanted a nice wide look with the um, with the stiletto. And I really liked it, um, but it was a lot of hard work for me. And like I said, it was the first time working with that nail tip. Now I know what to expect. So um, on another video, I'll go ahead and um, I'll work those nail tips so you guys can see how I work them. Um, they are very, very beautiful for my taste. And remember, you guys, not everyone likes um, this type of uh, nail tip. 
uh, usually uh, everyone likes to go with that real thin long stiletto look I kind of wanted something to look a little a uh, little thicker than just that thin look and to me I love these nail tips and definitely I'm gonna do some more nail designs with them I think they're really cute uh, they were a little hard to work with like I said uh, it wasn't easy, but I always like a challenge. Why not? It was fun either way. So right here, I'm going to go ahead and put some foils. And I think that really livens up the, the design. It makes it look really cute, sparkly. And we're going to use some of that green nail polish that I got. I actually got it for $5. It comes with the gel and the polish. So you can use either one. I personally like to use gel. I just think it's it's just better for me to use that than to use the regular polish. I feel like it lasts longer. Um, it does the shine doesn't go away, and when I do the polish, I feel like it takes away that shine. So as you guys can see, we're gonna use this green. It's a very very beautiful green. Um, I definitely love it. I feel that it really fits for the fall. It totally goes with um, with the weather time, uh, the fall vibes. So that looks really, really cute. I'm going to start um, a new design pretty soon. So I think I'm going to probably do some burgundies, maybe some orange. We'll go with some of those colors. I'm trying to stick to the the fall, the fall colors, and they definitely came out with some other new ones, the blues and all that. So I might want to try out some blue as well. But I think I'm gonna go with a darker shade. Um, I think I have this other video in here, and it's a blue. I definitely want to recreate that video again. And um, it's a matte finish touch to it, and it is beautiful. Um, I feel like I had gone too fast with those nails that I have in there, but even so, if you guys check it out, it's a beautiful nail design that I had done that day. I was gonna go out with my husband, we were gonna go somewhere to go eat, and I had to work with those nails super fast, and I believe they were um, the nail dip system at that time that I did. And I believe that was like two years ago. Um, I definitely did enjoy doing that set. And I did it super fast. Um, and it's a beautiful color if you do it in matte. So we're going to finish up uh, with some rhinestones that I wanted to add. On the second design, we don't put rhinestones. I'm going to leave it plain. So... Um, I told you guys story time. I have a short story time for you guys. Um, and this has to do with my children, actually. My kids are quite characters, you guys. I don't know if you guys have children like the ones we have. Uh, we had decided to do things differently with these. Like, we don't believe in this whole spanking thing. When we were kids, we used to get spanked. Um... And our families were really hard on us when it came to spanking. I won't go into details, but um, my husband and I had decided with our two little ones uh, that we were going to do things differently. And yeah, they're little brats. Uh, they like to miss a lot of school. So um, it's funny because um, I've had to call the schools to let them know. Like one time they went to a funeral. The next time they had a stomach ache. And... This time around, my daughter woke up and she's saying that um, she has puffy eye and that her eye is itching and all of a sudden the other one too because they put two and two together that um, they share the same eyeliner. So almost like made up stories. So here I am calling the doctor. The doctor's just like laughing like, oh my God, these kids just don't want to go to school. They go to school when they feel like it, huh? So that is my short story. Um... Let me know if you guys deal with these type of situations at home. Our kids do not like to go to school and they are very popular in school. They've got a lot of friends. Um, they just sometimes they wake up and they just don't feel like going to school. And I'm just like, oh, 
Um, what they've learned though through, through all this time is how to come up with great excuses. The whole um, excuse of the puffy of the eyes and all that she has an eye infection. That was a good one. I gotta give her props for that one, but but yeah, these kids are spoiled little brats, and I think that's a great story because these little kids keep telling me stories. Obviously, I fall for them. Um, you obviously can't force a kid like what? Am I gonna like throw her in the car and forcibly get her dressed? So uh, I'm just like, oh my gosh! The doctor was just laughing at me because the doctor's like, seriously. And I was like, right, what do you want me to do? Make them like, all I could think about is my next step is taking their devices away and uh, I guess restricting them from going to places. That's the only thing I can think of right now. But yeah, those are the lovely things my children have been doing. Um, there was this other story I was gonna share with you guys, but I forgot the story. And I had asked my husband, remind me of the story, because it was a good one too. And I really wanted to share that story with you guys. And I totally spaced out. Um, anywho, right here, I did a little bit of the clear gel, or I did the black um, gel polish. So I guess you can use either one, because I tried both. Um, I would suggest go with the clear top coat when you're doing the little design or a swirl. And then I use some of this foil paper and it looks really, really cute. So these are just simple little designs that you can do and you can totally fit it, fit in with the fall vibes. Um, and it looks really cute, you guys. So I'm thinking of doing another video for you guys. I'm going to use my two girls probably for models. And I'm going to bring you guys um, some fall designs. So stay tuned for that. I'll probably do either two or three nail designs in one video. So you'll just get to see the nail design and how it comes out. So you don't have to see the whole uh, putting of the nails and all that. And besides, I'll probably be using my kids for that. So they're not going to want to do their nails. Or maybe they will. I have no idea. But I have, I think, three or two designs that um, I found that are beautiful. Um, I believe one of them is uh, inspired by Justin Bieber's wife. She does that Aurora look um, with the chrome and all. It's really cute. If you guys want to see that, I think I'm going to do one of them on one of my kits. Um, I just ordered some of the chrome, so I'm waiting for it to arrive. Um, and I think it's gonna look really cute. It totally goes with fall. So right here as you guys can see we're on the second design. I had worked on one hand and it came out really cute that I was like oh I gotta do the second one. On my second hand I had taken off the other design so here we go with the second one and this one's very simple. We just put the blooming gel and obviously we don't cure it you guys. Don't forget because I tend to forget things I'm very forgetful. So we did one blooming gel coat and then I just used the black and the brown. And as you guys can see how I'm working it with the brush, I'm using a dotting tool. Um, I put enough of the brown. And this time I'm not really overthinking. I'm just looking for the little spots and just playing with the dotting tool and my brush. And um, this one was much faster and um, it turned out really, really cute. As you guys can see, you can see how I, ha I had encapsulated the foils and you actually do get to see it. And um, as I'm done with the design, it looks really, really nice. Um, I feel like this uh, tortoise look came out really cute as well. Um, I think they're both cute but i was not satisfied with the first one like i said i feel like i did way too much work on it and i i overthink things sometimes too much so as you guys can see on this one it is really really fast and simple you guys and a lot of us want simple so here it is 
very simple and it looks really really cute it totally fits in with fall vibes definitely I'm also going to do um, a chit chat with you guys. I haven't decided if I'm going to go live stream or if we're just going to do a video. Um, just questions that have been asked. I have to do that video too. I'm going to have a nice pumpkin latte spice. I'm going to enjoy that. I still haven't gotten it. Can you guys believe that? Every year I go and get my pumpkin spice latte and I haven't even done it. So I'm a little disappointed on that part, but I am going to go do it pretty soon. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Um, if you guys are new subscribers, welcome to my channel. Uh, we do all kinds of different little designs and I hope you guys enjoy my videos. I try to make them as short as possible and now I'm going to be adding uh sharing stuff with you guys and little story times i think that'll be a lot of fun for the channel um check out my shorts you guys i have uh asmrs um, my animals are in there uh we love noodles in this house so a lot of noodle videos in there um stuff that we cook and um don't forget to hit that little bell notification on the youtube um and they will send you uh, more video upcoming videos and all and that way you guys can stay updated with us as far as videos um, this is something that I love to do I've been having a lot of fun with it for two years I really enjoy my channel and what I do I love to share my ideas with you guys um, I'm very thankful and humble for all of your comments for people that get inspired by some of these nail designs um, you're all very welcome and I really appreciate all of your positive feedback for my channel and for supporting it. Let's enjoy the fall you guys. I'll see you guys here on my next video. Have a great one you guys.